Here we are at the MCG. It's been a few, few months between drinks. I think the last game I was here was potentially the Carlton game. I think it's been a couple of years for you, Mr. Yeah, since we rolled this round <laughs> two, three, a couple of years ago. 20, yeah, round three, 2019. Here for the big D's and Bombers clash. Um, look, coming off a loss against the Pies. The Bombers are in form against the Halls. Harry Jones in for a big one. Harry Jones, six goals. <laughs> Oh, I'd actually get excited. He's one of my favourite players in the comp. Uh, big test for the D's tonight. I'm going to go with the D's by 28 for my tip. Mina, how much of the Don's going to get home by? 21. 21. Not bad. All right, let's go D's. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, we... Come on, Dees! Come on, Armsy, for the first of the game. Directly in front. Yes! Well done, Dees! The sort of start to the game where if you haven't been here for 16 minutes, you probably haven't missed much. <laughs> Armsy with the first on the board. Been a very even first 17 minutes. One man up, Jake Stringer is waltzing through the middle and getting a really good look at it. 25 minute quarter, Dev Smith lining up on the siren to give the Bombers the lead. Dev Smith kicked under it. Quarter time at the MCG. The Bombers 2 3 15. The D's 1 5 11. Dev Smith has got the Bombers in front. Jay's Jack Tring has been good. I keep getting off the leash really. I would really reckon my legs are And it's a little bit worrying after he kicked about 12 goals last week and had about 50 disposals. So uh, I don't know. I was, I was quite happy with how the D's went. I didn't think we capitalised, but um, yeah, the Bombers, they've been, I don't know, really impressive. It's a bit boring. <laughs> it's a bit boring to start with. <laughs> a little bit boring. Jeez, you're in box position at the moment. The Bombers are up by four points at quarter time. Come on, D, he's got a lift. Second term about to start. I'd love to see Dogger get off the chain. Come on, Luke Jackson. <laughs> Bombers has kicked three in a row. And they're up and about, which is just making me so much more nervous. If someone needs to man. Yeah, Jake, Jake Stringer is walking it inside 50 and having good looks at it. Frustrating. Jeez, halfway through the second and the Ds are having an absolute mare. They are winning the territory battle at the moment. They've got it deep inside 50. Repeat entries, but they are munging it. Tommy Mack, Petrarca. Jeez, it's ugly. It's like they've had a week off. It's like they've had six months off, to be honest. Jeez, calamity after calamity. And that's our first goal since the start of the first. Just butchering every opportunity this mob. Two metres taking, taking a soaring mark. He's going to line up directly in front of the big fella. Oh no. <laughs> oh my. I thought that went at right angles. Dead eye Dick Peter. Langdon with the lob through ball to draw Don who's marked, he got absolutely fed in the marking contest. It's a good desperate effort by Thatcher, I reckon. And JJ's gonna line up to give the D's the lead. The Bombers fans don't like it. Yes! Half time at the G and the D's are up by three points. It wasn't looking very good. During that second term, the Bombers were going okay, but geez, it's tight. Yeah. What did you think of the James Jordan <laughs> It was very tight. It was a desperate lunge from Stringer. Just sort of took him out a little bit. Um, but it is tight. It is a tight contest here at the G. D's up by three points. I was a little bit nervous during that turn we wouldn't get the lead back because the Bombers were doing very well defensively. But big second half to come. I'm nervous. Come on, dude. Munching a meat pie in the freezing cold MCG Saturday night. Doesn't get much better than this. Jordan's been given the double 50. 
Directly in front, Bombers faithful, R.I. Rate. <laughs> Going for his second, I reckon. The track from the boundary. This will take his best. This will take his best. Come on. Yes! Come on the D's. Apple has banged one back. And the Bombers, enjoying a little bit of momentum. Feel like it's gonna be like this for the next quarter and a bit, a real seesawing affair. The Bombers, they get on late runs, which is making me very nervous. Waiting for the fourth quarter. Waiting for that fourth quarter, five goal pilot. He's have missed three or four set shots this quarter. Have not taken their chances. It goes down the other end, and Harry Jones slots one. So that's a couple in a row to the Bombers. They missed three or four opportunities from here this term, the D's. Track's lining up for another shot. They need this for some breathing space, only up by 11. Come on, track. Yeah! Yes! Come on, D's. Three quarter time at the G, and the D's have a 17 point lead. But it's not, oh, I don't know, I'm still quite nervous because the Bombers get their last quarter run on where they slot about six goals straight, so it's not over yet. But it's been a hard four contest, have you seen a bit of it? I've been swayed to, to the D's. Nauseous <laughs> <laughs> fans in this area, booing simply. I'm probably looking at There's been a few um, sort of Bombers fans not happy with the way the game's been officiated, there's been a few deliberate calls when the ball's not even out sort of thing, but um, yeah, I feel like the D's have had the rub of the green with a couple, but not as many that are getting appealed for. 17 points, three quarter time, the D's can drop away, the Bombers can turn it on, so it's not over yet, let's see how it all ends up, come on D's. Adding to the storyline of the D's getting away with it. I think it's been quite even most of the game, but G's track got caught red-handed in the forward line for the Bombers. Not paid. Geez, that was a bit of a let off. Come on, D's. Geez, Sparga caught one in the back with the Bombers fans. Didn't see it that way. Frida against the tide early in the last. Looks all right. No, Pack is lining up directly in front to reduce it to 11. Start of the last. Through the package. Oh no. Tommy Sparrow to quickly answer back the package's goal. It's going to take his best effort from 50. 45 degree angle. Looks alright. Yeah! A hooker to try and answer back and keep the Bombers alive. 20 minute mark, they're down by 17. He's going very quickly. He's a match winner, Kale Hooker. He bobs up late when they need him. Fourth quarters, Kale Hooker, he's always the best. Loves to stag late. It's 11 points, D's lead. 20 minute mark in the last. It is absolutely game on. <laughs> Fever pitch here at the G. This is a similar position to what the Crows pinched it off us from. Sort of coasting three goals up and then two quick goals and they're back in it. So, nervous times. Hot footy here at the G. Come on, Coz! Bombers with all the momentum. Can't be long left. I think they're going to escape here, the D's. A last quarter scare. Yes! Come on! It wasn't convincing, but they got the job done. Bombers broke in the last. <laughs> Good game of footy. Jeez, it was tight. My heart was going late. 
another professional victory, it feels like. The Bombers are a team to sniff at, so I'll take that one to the bank. Done and dusted at the MCG. The D's have gone home by 11. Oh, geez, that last quarter could have gone anyway. Yeah. Thought the package was really going to unload on us late. I think he might have a bit of a uh, package on those, but not to, not to be this week. Please keep down last week. So the Bombers, they got the Cats this Friday. Are you going to go in a GMHBA? They didn't pay me to go to see the Dons at that fucking place. <laughs> wouldn't get out of line. No, it's, um, it's not a great road trip, but for the Bombers, they can do it at West Coast, they can do it at the G, they can do it anywhere. I'm, I'm backing them in. That would be an absolute upset. You need to play in Western Australia again. That's yeah. the home ground. Yeah, move the home ground to Optus. All right, well, that's it from another AFL vlog. D's home by 11. I appreciate all the support. I appreciate everyone watching, and I'll see you all very, very soon. Cheers.